July is going to be hotter than ever because you get up to $50 off any smartphone at Appalachian Wireless. Two-year agreement required. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. I don't have any food. No, I don't. No, I don't. I wish I did, but I don't. This afternoon, after receiving an anonymous tip reporting several dogs which appeared to be malnourished and in poor health, the Johnson County Sheriff's Office seized more than 30 dogs from a residence on Little Laurel Creek in the Flat Gap community. Uh, when I arrived on scene, I seen the little dog sitting over here that's brown with the, the red uh, collar, and I already could tell it's within the one to three fat range, which means uh, it's going to need to go to a vet. Deputy Tussie, who is the designated animal control officer for the department, told EKB News that once the owner knew he was facing multiple counts of animal cruelty, he agreed to cooperate with the investigation. He's going to voluntarily surrender the animals for me, which means that we can, it'll move a lot faster. If he voluntarily surrender them, that means we, we can move faster and get the dog's help and get them to a foster home and get them adopted out. It was an anonymous tip to the sheriff's office that led to today's investigation. Deputy Tussie says as much as they try to patrol all of Johnson County, they still rely on the public to be their extra eyes and ears. Please call us. We can do what we can to get these animals help. Uh, like I said, this is one call that actually came through that was a true tip. So, 32 dogs were taken to the Johnson County Animal Shelter. Officials there say many of the dogs will require vet care and it will more than likely be several days before they will be ready for adoption. Reporting from Flat Gap in Johnson County, I'm Shannon Deskins for EKB News.